Hi there, and uh, welcome to another constellation video. Today we're going to look at Pisces the fish. It's the 14th constellation in size, and it's located in the Northern Hemisphere, nearby to Andromeda, Aries, Pegasus, etc. It belongs to the Zodiac, and it contains one single Messier object, the spiral galaxy of M74, which we'll look at later. It has 10 stars in it, with known planets. Major stars-wise, uh, Eta Piscium, or Kulat Nunu, um, is the brightest star in the constellation, and it has an apparent magnitude of 3.62, and it's approximately 294 light years from the solar system. The star's a yellow giant, about 26 times larger than the sun, and it has a faint companion. Gamma Piscium is a yellow giant. It's the second brightest in Pisces, and it has an apparent magnitude of 3.69, and it's about 138 light years distant. It's part of an asterism called a circlet of Pisces, which represents the head of the western fish. Omega Piscium is a yellow-white subgiant. It has an apparent magnitude of 4.03 and is about 106 light years distant, so it should be visible from clear dark skies. Iota Piscium, another yellow-white dwarf with an apparent magnitude of 4.13 and is 44 light years distant from us. And Alresha, or Alpha Piscium, is a close binary star. The primary star has a visual magnitude of 4.33. Uh, its companion has, a vis has an apparent magnitude of 4.23. And they orbit each other with a period of about 700 years. So it's a very slow binary. Um, combined, the two stars together have an apparent magnitude of 3.82. And they're about 139 light years distant from the solar system. Van Manen's star is a white dwarf, the third closest white dwarf to the sun, but it's the only, it's the nearest solitary white dwarf because the other two, Sirius B and Procyon B, um, are both binaries. It was discovered by the Dutch-American astronomer Adrian Van Manen in 1917, and it has an apparent magnitude of 12.37, and it's 14.1 light years away. 54. Piscium is another orange dwarf in Pisces with an apparent magnitude of 5.88 and it's 36 light years away. It has a confirmed planet in its orbit which was discovered in 2006. If I can pause for one moment and just say please subscribe to this channel. It means a lot to me because it shows me that people are interested in what I'm doing. Also it means a lot because YouTube see the subscriptions going up and realise that people like what I'm doing and, and they promote me as well. There's no money for me in this, but uh, please subscribe if you can. Just click the little button at the bottom. Thank you. Let's continue. Now, there are four asterisms, which, as we know, are bits of constellations that have a distinct shape within the constellation of Pisces. There's the North Fish, Pisces Borus, the North Chord, Linium Boreum, the South Chord, Linium Austrinium, and the South Fish, Pisces Austrinus. Deep sky objects in Pisces are Messier 74, as we said earlier, which is a spiral galaxy seen face on with an apparent magnitude of 10, about 30 million light years from the Sun, and with two very clearly defined spiral arms. It's a textbook example of a spiral of a grand spiral galaxy, believed to have about 100 billion stars in it. And it's part of the M74 group of five to seven galaxies in Pisces. The bright, it's the brightest of that group. Other members um, include NGC 660, which is a peculiar spiral galaxy and a few other irregulars. Well, please subscribe and uh, do take care and speak to you next time. Dark skies, stay safe. Bye for now.